Yes, sir. I also have Miss Kelly Lenz, the library director, here with me. Uh, this morning, we're bringing to you uh, FY15 Georgia Public Library Service Major Repair and Renovation Grant Program Application. This grant application allows for the South Georgia Regional Library to apply for a major repair and renovation grant that is administered through the Georgia Board of Regents and the Georgia Public Library Service. The grant application would supplement funding that Lowndes County currently has listed on the SPLOST 7 referendum if passed. The grant funding, if awarded, would be used on certain repair and renovation projects that staff has identified and coincides with projects that have been identified and estimated for the SPLOS 7 referendum. This grant is a local matching fund grant utilizing in-kind services, and if SPLOS 7 does not pass, this, the application would be null and void. The local match percentages are based on each repair and renovation project and would be re reviewed individ individually by the Board of Regents. Okay. Commissioners, any questions? I have a question. I understand this is the total is uh, 330000 Is that what I'm noticing here on the... No, sir. The, the total we put in for the t same amount that is on the SPLOS 7 referendum, uh, there, each, if you look in your folder, each repair and project has a cost to it. Uh, I believe there is eight applications. Each application refers to the SPLOS 7 referendum cost. And then if awarded, uh, we would get a percentage of each cost. Any other questions? I might have the, I don't know if I have what you're talking about. I, I just see where it has, uh, I guess, contract cost or what have you, the $10,000 uh, fee. You said you had something to say, 300000 or something to that effect. I'm looking I, I on page know. one of three just past our cover. It says total cost of project, 330000 Those are the numbers that are, um, that we had projected for the library uh, in the SPLOS. Right. And then this grant, uh, which is one that uh, Kelly and her staff presented to us. Kelly, would you? comment on how y'all arrived at that. I think we all kind of got <laughs> something different. To be I'm looking at Crawford, he's a little different than mine as well, but mm -hmm. uh, he's got 97, well, 97,000 on his, total 106. Okay. And I got 10,000. Yeah, 11, I, I think yeah, each one of us, she's got 109, <laughs> I've got 330. We need to, we need to get that clarified. <laughs> We'll check on that and make sure we get that for you. Did, did y'all allow Chad to get to the copier again? <laughs> <laughs> Chad, if I can go it, through them. If, okay, you like. if it would be, yes. it, I think it would be helpful. I think what the commission is looking for is. And I can make sure we get the, the right copies to each one of us. Just briefly discuss the projects, and if you've got a, a total amount there of, of projected grant uh, monies, if, if the grant is awarded. That's right. If you don't have it, it's fine. We can do it tomorrow evening. The first We're project prepared. is the uh, the RFID tagging for the books, uh, with a estimated project project cost of one hundred six thousand seven hundred dollars. That is one application. The second application is for the HVAC replacement and repairs, for total cost of project of six hundred sixty thousand dollars. The third project would be the roof replacement and repairs for a total cost of $330,000. The fourth project would be for life safety, facility integrity, and hazardous conditions and accessibility for a total cost of can you get us a copy of what you're reading there? Because we're not going to remember these numbers. And what okay. we have in our notebook, each each one of us have a different form of information. So that's why we're all confused. He, he will. I'm yes. just thinking Commissioner Page, oh, I just asked him to go over. I just asked him to go over briefly the okay. project. We'll get this information on paper, but I just wanted to go ahead and kind of go over, hit the highlights for us today. All right. Uh, the next project would be for structural repairs and a total cost of $11,000.
the next project would be the cosmetic and aesthetic improvements, interior upgrade and renovations at 82500 The next project would be to upgrade to the security camera system at 55000 uh, The next project would be an information technology upgrade of $330,000. I guess that's what I have here. Yes. And that would be total. And um, if you don't have the number, that's fine. Um, but approximately what percentage of these costs would the grant cover if the grant were they would if I talk to Sean right and Kelly may can hit on this more they could match up to 50% of each total okay. cost uh, each project that I just called out would be reviewed individually and then matched up to 50% okay. All right. okay good job all right thank you very much we'll we'll get that information yeah, I'll make this copy thank you all right thank you guys all right, here in Wyoming.